Okay, so here is passage 4 of Mark 19. So if you look at this particular passage, you realize that this passage is essentially a, a book review. So there is this book called The Invisible Kingdom by O'Rourke, somebody who happens to be a poet and a uh, and writer. So it is an illness memoir uh, which turns into, which becomes a detective story. So O'Rourke is a poet and writer suffering from several chronic ailments. Uh, and then she goes on to detail her experiences with the American medical system. And through this journey, she exposes a lot of flaws that they have. And uh, she, mentions, she mentions the apathy of the doctors. And then she eventually uh, talks about how she veers towards integrative medicine. That's what is mentioned in the last paragraph. So that's this entire passage in a nutshell. Question 16. Which of the following hypothetical statements would add the least depth to the author's predication of the American medical system being flawed for chronically ill people? Uh, if I were to simplify it, the question basically says which of the following least supports the author's argument with respect to American medical system for chronically ill people. So let us see whether they provide support to author's stance or not. A. American hospitals do not offer discounts for extended stays. Now you see, somebody who is chronically ill may require an extended stay. If you do not offer discounts, then it adversely affects chronically ill people. And that becomes a supporting element for author's point then. So if this is true, it will strengthen the author's argument. Ah, so this cannot be, so this strengthens, so let's see, eventually we can compare. We are looking for the one that least strengthens, right? B, research into chronic illness is of secondary importance, definitely strengthens. So I'll just keep writing an S. C, the American government is not willing to pay the medical bills for chronically ill people with the assumption that they can work. Strengthens. D. Medical insurance in America does cover chronic illness. If this is true, then this weakens the author's stance. And as a result, I can say that option D will provide the least depth. So we can mark that, we can choose that as our answer. So for question number 16, our answer is option D.